Hello, and welcome back to our course. We hope you enjoyed module three. In this fourth module, we'll be discovering online virtual and remote laboratories which you could use in your own classroom. As usual, we'll be joined by two guest lecturers. Firstly, Ton de Jong from the University of Twente in the Netherlands. <coughs> He's a leading researcher in science education and online laboratories, and he'll be taking us through the basic concept of online labs. He'll also be discussing how online labs can be used to reinforce inquiry-based science education in the classroom. Our second guest, Sophocles Sotiviu from Elino Germaniki Agogi in Greece, will take us into concrete examples of online labs which you could use in your classroom. After you've taken a look to these expert lectures, we'll invite you to consult the online materials which will be provided. This gives you more information on virtual and remote labs and on how you can embed them in teaching practice. After you learn more on virtual and remote labs, we'll ask you to join the forum to deepen and strengthen your knowledge. In the forum this week, we've got two activities. The first activity is to develop a lesson plan based on the virtual and remote labs we've presented. We'll ask you then to share and discuss your lesson plans with your colleagues. The second activity is to suggest some logistical challenges which you might face when you try to implement virtual or remote labs in your classrooms. It's not always easy to integrate new resources into your teaching practice, so we'll be keen in knowing your suggestions and ideas in that area. As usual, there is also a quiz to finalize the module. 